let's talk about three things. The simplest is avoid jargon. <laughs> I saw it frequently in recorded demos that I was I was reviewing. Uh, it was product specific. It was vendor specific jargon, and you often heard the phrase "what we call a blank." Nobody cares unless they're getting trained what you call a blank. So eliminate the jargon. Number one. Number two. You got to map to job title, and this goes back to the earlier comments that executives just need a little bit. They don't need to see all the details. Middle managers want to go a little bit deeper. Staffers want to understand just enough about the workflow to determine, is this going to be easier, better, cheaper, faster, for more productive for me, the ultimate consumer? Again, that goes back to the context. How deep do you want to go? It's the same, same principle as I said before. It's just enough to enable them to engage. One of the biggest challenges with most marketing teams is their desire to put as pack as many features and functions in automated demo as possible. They will say, these are our competitive differentiators. We have to include them. They're only competitively differentiating if they're relevant to this particular consumer. So you need to think very, very carefully in those terms. Um, and again, that goes back to context. <laughs> if the job title is relevant for that capability, fine, bring it up. But if it's not, you need to put it behind your back in a virtual sense. Those would effectively be the three things that I would I would recommend. Avoid all jargon that's that's not universally understood. Map to job title and then just go as deep as is necessary to get the conversions going. And actually leads to another point, and that is you got to test. You got to test, test, test. As humans, we're well. Hopefully, we are testing constantly when we're giving demos. We're asking ourselves, is this resonating? Could I have done this better? Did I, should I have included this piece? Should I have not included this piece, et cetera? We should be doing the same thing with automated demos. We should be A-B testing. We should be A-B-C testing and constantly looking at the results.